anti-aging and stretching. That doesn't sound really related, but today I want to share with you unconventional methods which might have a very interesting, very relevant result by using them. Hi, my name is Ralf, I'm from Anandao and our general subject is anti-aging, aging backwards, whatever you want to call it. And yeah, what can stretching do for that? So talking about anti-aging, it would be great if you share with us what does that term cover? What do you expect from an anti-aging workout as we offer it now? First of all, one always thinks about the looks, of course, looking younger, looking uh, more attractive, more sexy, etc. Many times it's also very important what your outside world is thinking about you or how they uh, perceive you or how they think of your youthfulness. Now, we want to extend that a little bit more. The way we understood it has also a lot to do of how you move, how you can do your physical stuff until the day is gone. Is it easy? Is it heavy on you? Do you feel an age coming? Etc. So, back to the stretching. Now, in China, there is a saying that one centimeter longer tendons. Tendons are like the strings which are connecting the bones to the muscles, like from the fingertips to the elbow, from the shoulders to the elbow. The ligaments are the ones which holding your joints together. So one centimeter of longer tendons give you 10 years of longer life. Now, that's a wonderful sentence. Assuming, of course, that this life will be full of joy, will be radiant, and you will be very present in that life. Now, let's look at it a little bit deeper. So stretching actually means that you will extend the length of your tenants. What is the result? Of such an extension. There is a higher demand for blood and liquids to go through it. Now thinking in that terms, blood and liquid we are considering as food. With every stretch more food would come to the cells which are extended. So in that way it makes a lot of sense. One centimeter longer 10 years longer life. Now, when you stretch, you're not only extending the tenons, you're also, depending on your move, moving or extending the ligaments and at the same time the muscles, which means you're creating a lot of demand for blood and liquid to come exactly at the area which you're stretching. The longer this area is, the more blood flow, the more circulation you trigger it. Which means a big part of your body will be supplied with hopefully good food, good blood, good juices. Now if cells becoming well fed, obviously it's much easier for them to create new cells on the one hand. On the other hand, it creates a more liveliness in your whole body. And the following exercises are highly recommended for you. As usually, we advise to do it eight minutes a day and do it for several days and see how you feel about that. So stand straight and relaxed. Then bring the left foot to the front onto your heel, arms coming up, then upper body is slowly going down and now grab with your hands your big toe or if that is not possible the knee or any place in between and begin to pull your chin 
towards your big toe. Then roll up, change side, right leg to the front on your heel, arms coming up, upper body comes down and you begin to move your chin towards your toe. Feel the stretch on the back of your leg. Extend the reach, rolling up. Change side again. Right hand to the back. Left hand is coming down, grabbing your toe, elbows inside your leg, and you begin to pull your ear towards your big toe. Then rolling up, change side, right hand, right foot to the front, left hand to the back, right hand grabs the big toe, elbow inside and pull your ear towards your big toe. Then roll up. Both arms coming up, fingers in the lace, push the palms to the sky and bend to the side. Bend from the hip upward. Feel the stretch from the hip to your shoulder. Change sides. Coming back, hands release. Then begin to circle with your hips. Let your arms hang, let your shoulder hang. Feet standing a little bit wider than the shoulder. And try to widen the circle a little bit. Change direction. Then come to the center, open your legs, then bend your right knee. The leg behind you is totally stretched and you begin to move your knee towards the front. Feel the stretch in the back part of your leg, change sides. Left leg is bent, right leg is straight. Feel the stretch on the back. Then turn inside, change direction again. Now we bend also the back leg and begin to move the back leg towards the ground. Your left knee is bending towards the ground, but not touching it. Then change direction, other side, right leg bend, move the knee down. Come up again. Then open your legs as far as possible. Upper body bends forward. Try to grab your ankles right and left, if possible, if not the knees or any place in between. Hold for a moment. Then come back, roll up your spine. Relax for one moment. Then stand shoulder wide, elbows coming together, chin pushing towards your chest, opening elbows coming far to the back, pulling 45 degrees, 
back down. Emphasis on pushing your chest forward and making the upper back round. Both hands grabbing the opposite elbow. Whip a few times. Feel the stretch. And then open. Open the arms, let the arms rotate to the back, hang down, hold for a moment. Whip a few times, open to the back, push the pelvis forward, hands coming down, hold for one moment, coming back. Continue the movement. Make sure you train in your own range. Don't overdo it. Then come to hands coming back to your center. We hope you liked our exercises and if you did, please give us a like and even better if you would share with us what is anti-aging, what is staying young for you, that would be excellent. Age in combination with modern lifestyle is affecting us severely in many aspects, which is adding up to the way we look, feel, perform and the success we can enjoy. In our anti-aging body-mind workout program, we empower you to feel and look useful, get fit and energetic, be focused and confident. Sounds interesting? Schedule a call to see if your dream can come through.